Okay, the mole is one that I find pretty tricky to get used to its movements. Obviously, it seeks you. It's always trying to get you. If you are one step away like this, you can actually move at him and it'll pop up but not hit you. I'll show you that. So that's the one enemy where it's okay to have only one space between because he also takes a turn to pop out. So he's technically two spaces, which is very confusing. If you're not sure, again, we're in the right spot. If you're unsure, one thing you can do is you can dig buffer to get the, okay, again, there. This is where you don't want him to be. If you try to hit him, you're going to lose your multiplier. So if he's directly behind you like this, you're going to want to dig buffer so that he pops out. Then you can hit him. These guys troll you in various ways. There's a few things they can do to really screw you over. They take out things on the floor. So they'll take out trap doors if you're in speedrun mode. They'll take out any kind of trap, bounce traps, any of those sorts of things, they take them out. So you want to be paying careful attention to that. Um, they lose your multiplier, so they're really annoying in Aria mode because they'll kill you. And the other thing is if they're on the other side of Tar, which I can't show you in this tutorial here, if they're on the other side of Tar and they're popped up, because Tar takes two beats, you'll be beside them and they'll be popped up, they'll take you out. And you gotta watch for that. So oftentimes you have to just avoid that situation altogether. If they're sitting in the middle of a tar pit, just avoid them. Don't even bother. Not worth it. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the moment.